Molly of Denali, Little Dog Lost, based on a television episode written by Mark Saslove and Kathy Wah. Hey everyone, it's Molly. Today, I'm having a fun day with my friend Tui and his dad Kenji. Well, we're helping train Toei's new dog sled, Anka. We hear a message on the radio. A cold snap is coming, everyone, Auntie Midgey announces. It's time to head home before it gets too cold out. Kenji zips away on his snowmobile and Toei and I take the sled. On the way back, Toei's sled hits a snowbank. We tumble off the sled. The dogs are all tangled up. It takes a while to untangle them all. Now, we just clip Anka back on. Where did Anka go? Toei asks. I looked around and see a set of dog tracks in the snow. Toei and I follow the tracks, but we don't see Anka. We head back to Toei's house. We hope Anka will be there. But Anka is not home at all. Don't worry, Kenji says. Huskies are built for the cold. Anka will find shelter tonight. If she's not home in the morning, you can go look for her. The next morning, Toei comes to my house. Anka still is not home. Come on, Toei, I said. We have a dog to find. Toei and I snowshoed to the spot where our sled crashed. We looked around, but Anka's tracks are gone. The wind has erased them. Luckily, I have a plan. I take out a box of dog biscuits. Let's leave a trail of biscuits back to your house, I say. If Anka sees the trail, she'll start eating. And end up back home, says Toei. We take turns making a trail. Soon, there are no more biscuits to build the trail. Maybe if we leave our clothes out, Anka will smell us and know to keep going, Toei says. We make a trail of clothes all the way to Toei's house. Toei and I wait for hours. But there's still no sign of Anka. I wonder what Anka is doing now, Toei says. A message comes on the radio. Turn your radio up for news, says Auntie Midge. She begins to report today's news. That's it, I say. Let's put out a radio message. We rush to the radio station. The radio station is really just Auntie Midge's house. I tell Auntie Midge that Anka is missing. Radio is a good way to get out news. Everyone listens to it, says Auntie Midge. A good radio message is short and sweet, just like me, says Auntie Midge. We write the radio message together. Toy makes the announcement. I need help finding my dog. Anka is a red husky. She has a red and white coat and a black spot on her left front paw, he says. Soon, everyone is looking for Anka. My mom looks by the trading post. Trini and Daniel look by the library. Grandpa Nat looks down by the lake. Toei and I wait to hear if anyone has seen Anka. Finally, the phone rings. I pick up. Hello? You saw a dog, I say, with a black spot on her paw? Miss Shu, I say, that means thank you. Someone found Anka. She is back on the trail. Kenji takes us on his snowmobile, back to the trail in the woods. Anka is curled up right on Toy's scarf. Toy runs up and hugs his dog. I guess she wanted to say where she could smell you, says Kenji. Toy ties his scarf around Anka's neck. Now you can smell me all the time, Toei says. The end.